Anna. Hi, Jenna. Nice to meet you. You look beautiful. Thank you. Gorgeous dress. Thank you. So, final destination. Have you seen all of the movies? I have seen two. <laughs> Which ones? See, I keep saying this. It's one with the roller coaster where the head got oh, decapitated. I think that's three. I think that's three. And then one with an airplane, right? Yeah. Oh, there yeah. you go. So one and three. Now yeah. I know. Thank you. <laughs> so for five, it's in 3D. How, do you like 3D or do you think it's going to make it more scary? Yeah, it probably will. I'm looking forward to it. I, I'm wondering, is this the final destination though? Or is I don't know. I mean, it's been like a whole decade of this. So Why not? <laughs> there could yeah. be a six and seven. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So do you like horror movies? Yeah, I or? do. I yeah. love horror films. I love them. That's great. Um, you have a new movie coming out, New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve. Tell us about that. It's so exciting. Yeah, New Year's Eve is a romantic comedy by director Gary Marshall, and it has some amazing actors. It has uh, Robert De Niro and Halle Berry and uh, Hilary Swank, who I worked with, um, and like a hundred more like A-list actors. So it's a really um, fantastic movie that's going to be, I believe our premiere is December 19th. So what's your role in the film? I play with I play with Hillary. <laughs> <laughs> Hillary uh, works for Times Square Alliance. Um, she's the one that you know is in charge of the actual ball dropping on New Year's Eve, and I'm oh. one of the reporters. And you know, not to give anything away, there's a little situation with the ball, and then you know, it's just like a whole thing trying to figure it out. So, yeah. do you have actual reporting experience, or was this a complete new role for you? No, it's a completely different role. I think I might have hosted one or two uh -huh. things here and there, but this was completely different. But um, when you're on the set with Hillary and you notice what a massive actor she is, you kind of just step up on your own. So, yeah. Do you have like any funny or embarrassing moments from the set that you can share with us? Yes, I do. I actually flubbed one of my lines oh. and Hillary went there and, and explained to me what my line was in front of everyone. Oh, and I no. was like, no, but it was good, you know, like she knew her lines and she knew my lines. So, was she rude about it or no? Oh, okay. No. <laughs> Are you kidding? She's like sweet, professional. Yeah. No, she was very sweet. Aww. And we played a lot of prank jokes on each other, so it was a lot of fun. Like what kind of prank? Uh, one of the actors in it is a gentleman by the name of Patrick Collins, and um, he's an older gentleman, and he would sometimes fall asleep oh, no. <laughs> in between <laughs> takes. So we. <laughs> This is so horrible. So one time he fell asleep um, in the green room in between, because you know we would work till 5:30 in the morning, and he fell asleep. And we had all these um, those little paper animals that like do this, yeah. you know those creepy ones. Uh -huh. And oh god, some of the actors put all the animals around him, and then tried to wake him up, and he almost had a heart attack because oh, he saw no. these little things coming on him. That's it was awful. really funny. I have it on tape. So what other projects are you working on right now? Um, actually, I just um, I've been auditioning for a couple of different things, and I just saw a script for another film, which I don't know if I can say it right now. But okay. I just got the script, and so let's see what happens. Awesome. Well, I wish you the best of Thank luck, and so have much. a wonderful time tonight. It's going to be a good ride, I think. <laughs> Thank, <laughs> Thank you. you.